And it was a small drama in Shele for inside the National Assembly. Sick of the chair, more of the Niger Delta Development Commission, NDDC, Professor uh, Kemebra de Kuma Ponde, being faint during one routine question and answer session for the ongoing investigative hearing for inside the commission. The House Committee for the Niger Delta Affairs, they mean they question the NDDC uh, man, a sake of a claim on top of Wuru of like 81.5 billion naira, uh, where they expected, say, the commission supposed to spend uh, when in faint in front of cameramen with the day. Our top talk person, Amadine Uyi, in Samao's Motori. The hearing commenced with the stepping down of the chairman of the committee, Honorable Olubumi Tunji Ojo who had earlier been accused by the chairman of the NDDC, Professor Kema Brady Ponde, of being an active player in the activities of the commission. In line with my belief that people deserve to be heard and to be heard fairly. Having said this, I wish to clearly appeal to my colleagues, though you pass the vote of confidence on me, the leadership, passed a vote of confidence on my personality as the chairman of this committee for the sake for Nigerians to know I'm not on a mission of vengeance. I wish to humbly appeal to my colleagues to recuse me from presiding over this particular meeting. I hope this will give you, this will give all parties opportunity to present their facts. The acting chairman of the committee took over and assured those present that the hearing will be fair and just. We are here as brothers and sisters. And we are here to do justice to the issue we have at hand. This is an investigation panel. It's not a probe. Nobody's been probed here. There are issues that we needed you to come and throw light on. That's why we're here. So as the proceeding goes on, we we'll ensure that everybody is giving fair hearing, but we also have to moderate to ensure that at the end of today, we have a good proceeding. Committee members took time to tackle the team from the NDDC over discrepancies in the commission's accounts. I've produced your submission, sir, and I've also seen the letter written to you. So for us to be able to flow seamlessly, you know, so that everybody will be on the same page, I expect that you should lay your approved budget where you derive the strength to spend the money you are, you are telling us. From where are you going to spend this money you said here on oath that you are preparing to pay students who are on scholarship? Are you aware that every expenditure you make from 31st May till date are not, are not... Suddenly, the unexpected happened. The chairman of the commission suddenly slumped much to the surprise of keen observers. The hearing was thus forced to adjourn for 30 minutes. With the chairman of the NDDC successfully evacuated from the National Assembly complex and taken to hospital, the hearing continued. Amadine Uyi, Plus TV Africa.